This is so that when people cut me off and want to let me down, I go up on camera. <laughs> Oh, oh, it feels so good to be back on the bike. It feels so good. The reason I have not been giving you more of vlogs is because it's crop over and I've been drunk. Marshall One Love. I went to that concert. It was freaking amazing. Marshall Montano and the whole band. Crazy. Tamaya was in the building. Rihanna performed. Ah, oh, ah. Oh, this is crop over in Barbados, people. Come on, for all you people who don't know. Oh, oh shit, it's cray cray, man. It was amazing. I mean, I didn't do as much stuff as I usually do, but the stuff I did do, oh my goodness, crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. I should have taken some stuff with my GoPro, but I'll be honest with you guys, I was selfish. I just wanted to have a good time. I don't want to be one of those guys with selfie sticks in the party. No, nah, I'm sorry. I wanted to have fun. I paid my money. I wanted to drink. I wanted to eat. I wanted to walk up. And that's what I did. So guys, on to my big announcement. I am actually starting my first job tomorrow. Well, my first job. It's not my first job, but I'm starting a new job tomorrow. Yeah, I got a new job. And I am totally, totally, like, freaking over the moon about it. Um, more so because it's a really funky, wonderful, and young company. Kind of has, like, that real startup kind of vibe. Which, in Barbados, that's pretty hard to find because... Most of the businesses in Barbados are very traditional. You know, so, you know, creativity, they're not all about that stuff. But this company, I, from the time that I saw the posting, it just felt like what I should do. So I went for it. And I spoke to my girlfriend about it, Mrs. Syke. Hey, Mrs. Syke, shout out to Mrs. Syke. I love you, baby. And, and I... I decided, yeah, I'm going to go for it. And it felt right. You know, I'm, I'm a big believer in, in following your heart. I'm following your mind. Hopefully those two things will be going in the, in the same direction. Sometimes they don't. <laughs> and um, I sent it in and I got a response almost immediately. And from then on, I, I went to the interview and it was like, it was like family. It was, it was really surreal. You know, job interviews are usually very nerve-wracking for most people and I get nervous but I get like a good nervous I I kind of like the challenge communicating with people and telling people about me and stuff like that and, and this is my number one tip for job interviews be genuine I'm not I'm not saying go in there and like you know do shit like um, burp and fart and like, like be, be real crazy but just be genuine when be honest be genuine a lot of people go in and and they want to lie about stuff that's on their cv or what they've done you know they want to look good you know a job interview is like a first date oh that was sippy it's like a first date so people want to show the best naturally you want to look your best you want to present yourself but Interviewers, interviewees, interviewers, people who interview you, your employer, potential employer, they know. They know when you're bullshitting. They interview people all the time. So if they don't feel that genuine nature coming through, that genuine vibe, they're not gonna they're not gonna be about it, man. So that it, it works for me and hopefully it will work for you. So um interview went completely well. You know, we ended up talking about motorcycles. What was that? Oh, okay. I thought a call was coming through. We ended up talking about motorcycles and stuff. It was it was so nice, man. It was so freaking nice. So I'm super excited. My first day is tomorrow. I picked out what I'm going to wear. I'm going to wear polka dots. Yeah, family. I'm going to wear some... I'm going to wear some polka dots and stuff. And, uh, yeah, really looking forward to it. Really am exciting times, exciting, exciting times. So, what I'm where I'm at right now, as you can see, I'm coming down. 
I don't usually take this way down to town just because it's bumpy as you can see but I want to show you guys something different and I'll be bringing you a lot of different vlogs you'll get to see me commute to and from work which would be very interesting because we're where the job is is pretty far from where I live and it's a ton of traffic either way usually a lot of traffic and you know what traffic means right traffic means that we get to see random we get to see the most random stuff so you guys will get to see some some pretty random stuff you get to see different parts of Barbados man I'll even do like some little mini vlogs when I go to uh, blah 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 when I go to lunch when I hop on the bike and I go to lunch you know and I still want to bring you guys the jewel vlogs I just have to get the money to buy the second camera, the second mic, the earpieces and stuff for Mrs. Psych so that we can do that. Um, I'd like to start back the dual vlog series with Jack of Two Wheels where he's been super busy. Busy doing his CrossFit thing. He's in the competitions and shit now. Yeah, man. So shout out to Jack of Two Wheels. We want to see a video from you, bro. It's been a minute. And if I can say it's been a minute, you know it's been a minute. So, uh, yeah, man. Thanks so much. And I love you guys. Thanks for sticking with me. Even in my little semi-dormant period. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. Um, yeah. And tag along with me for this ride. I love you guys. Psych Moda out. Peace.